it's really very thrilling that these three companies, ACT, Marine Theatre Company and The Magic are all collaborating together to put this terrific epic together. This is the work of a young playwright, but you wouldn't know it reading the plays, seeing the plays. It, it feels like uh, you know, a master already in its craft. The world, the, the writing, the dialogue, and the characters of the play are fantastic and so incredibly compelling to me. A language. It's gorgeous language. It's not going to be self-consciously poetic either. No, he won't let you do that. His language is down and dirty and coarse and gets, goes from the profane all the way to the sacred in a single sentence. It's very rare that a contemporary playwright takes the leaps that he does and really creates his own world in the way that he does. It's very similar to the Greeks, it's very similar to a lot of mythology, um, and it's very similar to your Reuben myth. I was just really very, very, very moved by the writing. As a playwright, I felt like these are the kind of plays I wish I had written. In the Red and Brown Water is the story of Oya, who is a young, uh, gifted runner with exceptional promise and possibility who is faced with a number of really, really difficult choices early on in her life that force her to grow up very fast. I'll be directing The Brother's Size. I was struck by its theme, which seems to be about manhood, about what it means to be a man. It's about the love that they share with each other, the, the, the suspicions that they have for each other, the jealousies, the struggles for supremacy. They're engaged in a long ceremony of manhood. That's what this play is about. Marcus, or The Secret of Sweet, concerns a 16-year-old boy named Marcus. His search for an understanding of his father and his family, and his coming to embrace the power of his dreams and their meaning. The story of a boy coming out is, is very moving, and telling it in the frame and the context of this world is really uh, something that I'm really proud of. Seeing all three of them, really, you start to see how the threads, both thematically and, and character-wise, sort of weave through all three of them. And it really kind of builds on itself. There's a, there's a cumulative weight to them that's really phenomenal. I believe each of the three theaters are doing the play that they love the most. And that <laughs> is really outstanding. We're all three different directors. We are going to have a different approach. It's very, very rare that even two theaters collaborate together. As much collaboration as we do in the theater, for some reason, theaters themselves don't collaborate a lot. And so for the three of us to be able to collaborate on this and really present this for the city, that's a really special event. It seems like it's happening organically in the Bay Area. Yeah. And it has to. This climate, we need each other. Yeah. Yeah. We really do need each other.